Your Excellencies, Ladies and Gentlemen, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Welcome to Saudi Arabia, where future is being built today. Last week, the World Bank announced Saudi Arabia as the most improved country in the world in doing business. And this is just one indicator of the rate of change. A rate best described by a World Bank executive commenting in the new ranking, quote, something clearly is happening in the Gulf which has not happened before. We are writing a new chapter for us and also for the generations to come. We started three years ago with the announcement of the Saudi Vision 2030. To achieve this vision efficiently, we need to make the right data-driven decisions, and this requires a lot of meaningful data and also to generate as many insights from this data as possible. And here comes the role of artificial intelligence. To tell you more about what AI means to us here, I'll take to you about the one, the two, the three, and the four. So, one vision with two conditions, three objectives, and four actions. Starting with the one. We acknowledge that data is the oil of the 21st century. And we have therefore set for our nation one clear vision to elevate the country to a leading position among the world's pioneering AI-based and driven economies. For this vision to materialize, two conditions must be met. First, to set a good example for the world and how a nation can and should unlock the value of data and AI to improve the life of everyone in the country in Saudi Arabia. Second, we need to actively lead and facilitate the global dialogue to shape the future of AI for the good of humanity. Let me spend some minutes on the first condition. To set a good example for the rest of the world, we need to succeed on three fronts or objectives. First, unlock the value of data and AI for the whole government. Second, is to accelerate the adoption of AI in the private sector. Third, is to build and develop human capital specialized in AI and data science. So, what are we doing here in the kingdom to achieve these objectives? We believe we need to action four points. And we are already making significant progress on all four. First, we need to establish a clear national governance. And I am glad that only a few weeks ago, the Saudi and the Saudi Data and Artificial Intelligence Authority 
has been established to lead the national data and AI agenda and is empowered, as you can, as you can see, with the highest authority in the country. Very few entities around the world have been given this empowerment. Second, we need to be able to unleash the full potential of government data. And this will be the role of the National Information Security, National Information Center, NIC, an entity which is being transformed and moved under the Data and AI Authority to be the National Data Bank hosting all government data and also to be the main government insights provider using the power of AI. Third, we need to level the playing field for everyone to create value of the data. And for this, we are establishing the National Data Management Office as the main national data regulator to create and enforce data policies and standards and to enable government entities to adopt data best practices. Fourth and last, we need to drive a continuous innovation and enablement on data and AI. And there comes the role of the National Center for Artificial Intelligence, which will drive AI strategy execution and also, over, also orchestrate AI research and develop AI solutions. And lastly, build the AI, ex AI expertise and human capital. So, one vision with two conditions, three objectives, and four actions. Let me go back to the two conditions. The first one is ticked. Alhamdulillah, finished. But what about the second? leading the global dialogue to shape the future of AI for humanity. It is my pleasure to announce the Global AI Summit, which will be held here in Riyadh in March 2020 under the patronage of His Royal Highness Prince Mohammed bin Salman. It gives me also the pleasure to invite you all to attend and actively participate in the summit. <laughs> the summit will be a unique annual platform for global thought leaders, decision makers, and innovators to showcase, debate, and also shape the future of AI for governments, for private sector, for NGOs, and also to identify new business opportunities during the summit, and also finally to reach the final and ultimate objective, which is to amplify AI's positive value for humanity. So, see you all here in Riyadh next year. See you.